now here is another video about describe quickly in this video i'm gonna tell you about intel versus amd so uh, we all know amd and intel they're um, semiconductor company companies and uh, intel is the most popular right we all use intel chips intel processors core i5 core i3 core i7 most of us, most of us don't even know what core i5 core i3 3 and Core i7 means. I'm gonna describe this in a, in the next video, so stay tuned and uh, let's get back to our track. Intel versus AMD, right? Uh, Intel is a better option for me because Intel is uh, Intel has multi-core processors and even AMD has multi-core processors, but the uh, single thread single thread performance of Intel is far better than AMD. This is the pros of Intel and Intel is more compatible to most of our uh, motherboards and most of the motherboards are uh, we use and available in Bangladesh or our country, most of the countries are Intel. A AMD is also available but those are not popular so we, we don't use that. Now, uh, so these are the pro pros of A Intel. Uh, now, let's talk about AMD. AMD holds the world record of the highest clock speed. It's 8.5 GHz. 8.5 GHz was never caught by Intel. And uh, Intel never made 16 core processors before 2010. But AMD made 16 core processors, bulldozer, on 2010. Yeah, maybe 2010. Now, uh, AMD is very low costly but gives better performance than Intel at a very low price but the problem of AMD is it doesn't have a good performance at single thread it, it has multi-thread performance and the good thing about Intel is it has turbo boost and the power consumption is less in Intel but in AMD, the power consumption is too much and there is no turbo boost. So even when your processor is at sleep, it's gonna run at uh, it's gonna run at the base clock speed and uh, when it's at the highest highest speed, uh, I, I mean when it is in the workload, then it's gonna be in that speed. So there is no variation of uh, what can I say? There is no variation of clock speeds. I'm gonna describe about turbo boost in the in another video, so I'm not gonna describe it now. Now, uh, a, a, another p uh, pros of AMD is AMD is uh, AMD is good for gaming, and uh, AMD has dedicated graphics inside their processors. Like there are uh, some processors of AMD which are com which are like. CPU plus GPU, but Intel has Intel also provides some GPU facilities so that we can run at least 4K videos by uh, Intel graphics I by an Intel CPU, which has uh, graphics into it. But it's not good for gaming. We all know that. So basically, this is it about Intel and AMD. If you know more information, please let me know in the comment section. If you like the video, please hit the like button. If you think the video sucks, you know what to do. Just hit that dislike button there. And if you think your feelings are more complicated than like and dislike, then there's a comment section below. You can use that. Uh, and you can also message me. There are links of my uh, Facebook account, my uh, Twitter account, my Google Plus account. Uh, I'm regular at those social networks, so you can uh, you can message me or let me know anyway and uh, basically that's it thank you for watching my video this is section if you think that if you uh, want to stay tuned with us please hit the subscribe button and uh, support support me at least <laughs> thank you